Hey, this week's What's New is brought to you by Tunex. Spring is coming, it's almost here. We take care of these vehicles that take care of you. Hi everyone, welcome back to At Your Leisure. I'm Sam the Gadget Girl, and today I'm here with Clint from Rhino Hitch, and he's gonna show us these absolutely revolutionary hitches. Hey Clint, how's it going? Good, how are you? Good, so tell me a little bit about what sets this hitch apart from other hitches. What this hitch does and it allows you to do is to be able to adjust your hitch very quickly by just pulling a pin and going up and down. The other benefit to it is the fact that you can adjust your trailer while it's still hooked up to the trailer. You will have your trailer coupler on here. You'll either use your jack to go up or down to level out your load. The reason why you want your load level is because you get uneven wear on your tires and you could fish tail. All right, so what is this little rubber cover for? So what this does is it protects the shank when you're not using the ball system. What it is is it's a converter ball system. You just take this off, you put it on there, just a quick change. If you ever need to change it, you use your cotter pin to move it out. Wow. Do the other one. So pretty much this hitch is perfect. I would hope so. <laughs> <laughs> I'd really like to see it in action. Okay. All right, well, let's see this bad boy in action. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna pull the pin. Then we're gonna use, use the jack. We're gonna crank it up. Oh, wow. And what this does is if you're loading something on there that is maybe too heavy that you've never done before, or you wanna get something on and off a trailer, it's gonna safely do it. And then if we wanna go down with it, we just let her down. I have never seen a hitch that can do that before. One of the benefits that I have noticed when I first started using the uh, hitch was the fact that I was not hitting the jack on my trailer anymore. Most trailers have a really close nose jack and this hitch allows it to get out just enough so it will clear it. So you said that all of these are made here, correct? Yep, they're made right here in Salt Lake City, Utah. Can we go check out how that's done? Yes, we can. All right. All right, this is where it all happens. So tell me a little bit about the process here. So what we'll do is we'll take our stock material, we'll put this in the saw, cut it down to its uh, desired width, which this one is a two inch. Okay, perfect hitch size. <laughs> exactly. And what we'll do from there is we'll put it in the mill, we'll mill it, drill it, get it ready to go to anodizing. And this is what the finished product looks like after everything's said and done. And that's perfect and it's, it'll help it from getting corroded, right? Yes. Perfect. Today we've gotten to see all about these incredible hitches. Thank you so much for having us. Thanks for coming in. Um, we got to see today how these are made and really what these hitches can do. And if people want to find out more, what should they do? You can go on Amazon or go on rhinohitch.com or come visit us at 39 South and 449 East. All right, guys. Well, thanks so much for watching. We'll be right back with more at your leisure.